welcome to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome to you going to be reading for the lovely libra so libra what are we doing this week i sat quietly and i thought this week um color was important to the different star signs for different colors okay and there's a reason for the color i chose for each star sign and i sort of incorporated in my poetic words this week so for you libra it was wear something brown this week in order to ground your soul. Feeling rather anxious, it's time to let go of negative thoughts that have you worrying about your future that is so far away. Time to enjoy the here and now, live for the moment and today. So, my lovely Librans, wear something brown this week. Easier obviously if you're a girl but you can have a brown stone in your pocket or wallet or purse you can just have a color of paper on your person but i felt brown was uh, significant for you because it's about grounding your energy i feel at the moment you're like an electric current that hasn't got a, an earth okay and one minute you're sort of running around on full battery and then the next minute you're sort of depleted and on a flat battery so your energies are sort of up down up down and i felt brown for you was going to sort of harness and give you um some help it'll just help ground this energy that is sort of all over the place so let's start shuffling the card shall we and see what is coming out for you this week what have we got for libra spirits what do they need to hear what do they need to see please bring out the cards on the table for me what have we got for libra another two please spirit And one more. Top one. Right, Libra, let's have a look what your story is this week. What have we got going on with your energies? We have the chariot. We have the page of swords. The knight of wands. And the king of pentacles the chariot comes out for you you're on a fast pace energy this week so you start off the week feeling that you've got to act on something quickly there's an idea that's coming in here for you it's like a light bulb moment for you this week libra and you need to strike while the iron's hot okay you're pursuing something this week it could be that you are seeking some information seeking some knowledge but you're on the right path saying you're on the right path in trying to discover something or as I said put something into place there's a notification coming in this week as well I feel a letter will come in and you think to yourself I didn't expect it to happen so quickly it's like a decision has been made for you a decision that you have been waiting on that you didn't think would come so quickly it's as though you sat on your laurels and thought nah I am not going to hear uh, about that information I'm not going to hear from that job I'm not going to hear whatever it is that you thought was going to be a longer process it comes in quicker than you think okay so you could have a letter coming this week it could be an appointment it could be um, a job offer um, there's more than one iron in the fire here okay for some of you not all of you but there is something coming in quicker than what you expected 
the Knight of Wands comes out then. Okay. And this is protecting yourself. Keeping your distance as well. Knowing your sort of... Um, knowing your limits. Okay, Libra, knowing your limits here. In other words, not to burn out too quickly. There's this crazy wild horse energy around you. And as I said, when I came in, I felt like this was your energy at the moment. It's like one minute you're full of so much energy, this crazy energy. And then the next minute, it's like you're depleted of it. Okay? But you've got to sort of work out your boundaries. But it's saying you've got to harness the, the energy. This is another. It's okay. They're just telling me about... You've got to learn to harness your energy. Don't let it run wild. Because I feel... Whoever I'm picking up with, you struggle... Okay, so like I said, it's like one day you feel like you could knock the house down and then the next day you feel like you couldn't even lift your arm up. Do you know what I mean? It's like a crazy type of energy that I'm picking up with some of my Librans. But you're nearly there. Because if you look at the Page of Swords, it's like she's nearly on the other side. It's like I've been, it's like this... You've been stuck between a rock and a hard place, but you are coming out of this slowly, okay? But it's information, communication that you didn't think would come in so quick. And it comes in like a whirlwind, leaps. It's like you'll have to act on it, okay? Um, and it'll feel like this crazy energy but you'll finally be getting somewhere because we've got the King of Pentacles. I also feel the King of Pentacles is about um, money as well that is coming back to you. It could be money that's been owed to you, but... In a metaphorical sense, the person was loyal. And this money is coming back. Okay? Where you thought maybe it wouldn't, it will. Okay? So let's get some clarification on these cards then. So, what else have we got for Libra? So we've got the chariot. The page of swords. The Knight of Wands and the King of Pentacles. So, with the Chariot, we have the Four of Earth. Okay? And, as I said, this has been your energy. You've been in this fragile situation and I do feel it's around your health. But something is coming in quicker than you expected. And it's saying you've spent a lot of money in trying to solve this situation, okay? It could also, as I said, for some of you on jobs, fast moving, and it's like to say something is offered to you this week and it could bring you more money. But you're in this fragile situation of do I take it? Didn't expect it to come in so quickly. Didn't expect this change. So with the Page of Swords, we've got the King of Water. And it's the force of how this comes in. If you think of the power of water and how we've got no control on the tides and what have you, this is being brought in. 
before the universe. Because they know how this is affecting you inwardly, whatever this situation is. Okay? I want to say the tide is turning, but in your favour. Okay? So the next card that comes out for you, look at this. Messenger of Earth with the Knight of Wands. There's going to be something coming in for some of my Librans and it's on a documentation and it's about money issues but it's in your favour, okay? And you'll think to yourself, this is a crazy, crazy situation to be in. I can't understand why this has happened. I didn't expect this to happen. And we've got the Queen of Air with the King of Pentacles. And the Queen of Air, again, is communication. And I said I feel this is somebody who owes you money or has loaned something from you and you just didn't think you'd get it back. But it's saying they are going to be loyal in this situation and you will get back what's owed to you. It's all about communication this week, Libra. It's all about communication and it all comes in quick. It's just fast paced, okay? And it's a crazy energy, a wild energy and there's a force behind it. Okay, there's a force behind this. So, let's have a look at what your hidden psyche is feeling this week. What is your hidden psyche? I want to say as well, because there's a king and queen here, two heads are better than one in a situation as well. If there's something that two heads can get together and make money from as well which is interesting but deep within your inner psyche is imagine and your inner spirit is saying there's a silver lining coming on here just got to hold on a little bit longer okay you're not sleeping still it's like you're desperate to try and get in a normal sleeping pattern as well there's a silver lining coming in for you so let's have a look how the universe sees you Libra what else have we got for Libra but I do feel for some of you Librans there's somebody who's very wealthy in a position where they're going to offer you um, a job offer or some kind of offer or as I said it's some money being paid back so that's interesting. How's the universe seeing you this week? And it's the magician. I always look at this as Merlin. As like Merlin energy. You can harness anything this week to work in your favour. And it's also about the universe working behind the scenes for you. Look at this electric energy as well. All this electricity in this card. And this is what they're trying to... The universe is understanding what's going on with your energy levels. It's all over the place and it's got to be harnessed. Okay? Uh, and they're trying to assist you with this. Okay? They're trying to assist you with the up and the down and what's going on at the moment. So, let's have a look at your animal spirit. Actually, before I do the animal spirit, let's just get your moon phases card this week. What else have we got for Libra? And there's something for somebody about somebody with a scar on their face is, is significant this week as well. Or somebody's going to get hurt and they'll have a scar left on their face. Okay, so to be mindful there. Then we've got action. 
okay the universe is bringing in some kind of action a full moon here as well as i said you're nearly at the end of a process here but it's coming in faster than what you thought so this is interesting let's have a look at your animal spirit cards then what's going on there what else have we got for libra And we have, wow, the alchemical sign of water, but then we've got the alchemical sign of earth. This is the energy you've been in. Everything's just been, oh, you've had to adapt so much to so many situations and you've had that many, you know, it's been raining on your parade that many times, okay? But you've weathered this and you're going into this energy. Can you see the electric again in this? This is the energy I was saying about, you've got to, this energy around you is so manic at the minute okay and this is why you've got to ground yourself it's an earth element hence why i said the color brown for you this week and it's like saying you've got to get this stability and this stability is coming back in your life has been really wishy-washy i want to say wishy-washy for you funny word isn't it that wishy-washy but it has been a deluge of emotional downpour for months okay but finally um you are feeling more stable and grounded coming in so let's have a look at your messages from spirit this week okay i want to say back breaking because my back feels like it's breaking at the moment now as i'm reading this that's my back right then let's have a look at your energy guides and angels what do you want to tell them free will for libra the answer to your question is no yet remember you have free will you are free to make your own decisions just remember that you need to take responsibility for any choices you make meditate and see what your heart says okay the answer to your question is no so there's something that you're thinking within your mind at the moment or you're trying to manifest to the universe and the universe is saying no it might but not be the right time okay no don't think in a negative energy it all depends on how you take this card guys but look at the color of the card and it's green and it's about health for the majority of you it's about health i want to say no don't give up I feel like I want to give up and the universe is saying no don't give up but at the end of the day you have free will and you can decide what you want to do regarding your health if that's the case so I'm just going to get one more card and I'll do it from the fairy realms this week what else have we got please for the lovely Libra and don't forget guys if this is not you directly and it doesn't resonate with you it could be somebody close to you or a cross watcher but also check out your moon and rising signs because there could be additional messages there that resonate with you better than this one so yeah sorry anyway libra practice 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 with daily practice you can polish your skills and talents and increase your confidence so we always say practice makes perfect but i want to say to you practice patience okay i just feel practice patience okay and have confidence in your own beliefs libra have confidence in your own beliefs so my lovelies don't forget as i said check out your moon and rising signs if you are new to my channel any comments likes guys subscribes helps me keep growing and it's just a little bit of appreciation back and it costs nothing so until next time you take care of yourself bye then